Multiflex 40 Position Tool Post. This is a short video. It's intended for apprentices. Basically, it's on positioning of the tool holder. The reasoning behind this is they're doing it wrong. I apologize for some of the sound quality. We are wearing masks in the machine shop and it is a little bit loud. Before we get started, if you could please like and subscribe, I'd appreciate it. Okay, let's get started right now. As most of you are aware, on a standard turret type tool post, it's that large nut in the center that you use to rotate your tool post on your compound rest. On a multi-flex tool post, in most cases, this will still work. However, it is not the preferred method on a multi-flex tool post. Anyways, we're gonna see if we can move this tool holder to a different angle. The way we do that with this particular piece of apparatus is we're gonna undo the cam lock usually anti-clockwise however it can be tightened up clockwise as well we're going to make sure it's in the loose position we're going to remove the tool holder and then we're going to rotate the jacket around to whatever angle suits us at the time then we're going to put the tool holder back in place and tighten the cam lock back up in a clockwise motion and that's it nice and firm and tight now that you have your tool angle set it's time to set your height so you want to loosen off the cam and then lift the tool up and down slightly then tighten the cam slightly till there's a little bit of drag that will stop the tool from sagging as you're doing your height adjustment with the cam in the loosened position all you need to do is rotate the micrometer height adjusting screw to raise and lower the tool if you're unsure on how to set the tool height or just would like a refresher go to my youtube channel shop and math and look for the video setting tool height on a lathe there are four different methods or the main four different methods are covered in this video if you have any comments on this video or have suggestions for other videos please leave them in the comment section below and a special shout out to simon a big thank you for being the collaborator on this video with me if you want to see more videos just like this check out my youtube channel shop and math and if you've not done so already please like and subscribe it's free and it'll help me out Thank you for watching the video and have a great night.